I'd like to show you a few things about Google Slides. Um, I'm doing this on the computer, so what I'm talking about today is basically computer-based. Some of the features you may be able to do on the iPad, but not necessarily all of them. So I'm on a computer on a Google Chrome browser, and I have a Google Slideshow that I've started creating for my McCall presentation coming up soon. And I think a lot of you already know that you can do a theme, and I have themes, and you can see I did use this theme here, but I, like the font doesn't match. So I found ways that you can change that. You may not have ever noticed in view, there is something called the master. And this will change, um, this will edit those master slides. And you'll notice, I think, um, right here, I edited my title slide, and then I also edited like I wanted a picture on one this slide every single time. So if you go through, you can go ahead and you can change, like you select the font and you just change your font up here, and then you add like a picture to that one. Every single time you use that slide layout, it will follow those rules. And then you can click on, um, you know, a reapply to all, which I need to be careful. I think I have it the way. Once you're done editing, there's a little X here. Tap on the X. And I'm going to take themes off. Um, other thing I wanted to show you besides the master view was how to make your presentations a little more interactive. So if you're presenting it to a class or to um, like a group of adults, if you click on present, you're going to notice it's going to switch into my presenter view here. And hopefully this is large enough. Um, so right now it's ready for presenting. On the bottom, I'm going to tap on presenter view. And then it's going to pull this thing down. I'm going to pull this in a little bit more so you can see it. All right, so I get these choices. And there is audience tools right here. And it tells me this is what I'm looking at. I'm on slide one. This is the one coming next. But audience tools is really neat. Um, I'm going to start new. It will set up if I would like to have people be, to be able to submit questions. And right here, I'll go ahead and submit this. Questions will appear here. I have it on. And if you notice in my slideshow, right at the top of it there, it says ask a question. Somebody could go ahead, tap that in, and ask me a question. While I'm presenting, it is going to pop up here. I can still see what I'm doing and manage that as well. So hopefully this will help you to be able to save some time by making your presentations go smoother. Uh, you can create them faster by using that master view and then also do more audience participation.